TJ, Glen Oak at Stowe. When I look at this Stowe team, they've got big wins over 9-1 and one Barberton, 7-3 and three North Royalton, 8-2 and two Nordonia, 8-2 and two Hudson. Average about 35 points a game. This is a quality Stowe team. I don't know about that. I'm, I'm smelling upset special right here. <laughs> Coming out. Golden Eagles. <laughs> out. I I'm love smelling it. upset special, right? We're talking brackets. <laughs> Listen. Brackets? You're going to have, Playoff? throughout the entire state, you're going to have two, a 215 somewhere that's going to win. A 15 is going to win. You're going to have that here in a 3 and a 14. Uh, Glen Oak, I just mentioned to you, they're getting better. This is a team that's getting better. They're going to get confidence after that win over Perry. They're going to roll into the playoffs. Scott likes where his team's at. They have everybody healthy pretty much. Isaiah Knox, he's rolling at a pretty high pace. The offensive line has gotten better even though they're not big boys up front. You know, they have a line that plays together. They're gelled. And defensively, they're hitting people in the mouth. Upset special. Golden Eagles are going up there to beat Stota. This Bill team, they've got quality wins. T.J. over Cardinal, who is 7-1. LeBray, who is 9-1. Brookfield, who is 6-3. Defense pretty tough, too. They only gave up uh, 36 points. That was the most points they gave up all season in yeah, the game. Anthony Dima, he just set the single-season rushing record for the uh, for the G-Men. And, yeah, they're going to be tough to compete with. But Sandy Bally's going up there. They know one thing. Mason Tucci's got to come out with his hair on fire. You know, he leads the defense. He makes big plays on offense. And Wyatt Moyer, big 72. Watch out for 72 making <laughs> plays in this game on the road. 72 always shows up in the, in the road whites. Absolutely. Now we look at Division 6. I'll tell you, I really like Malvern in this game. Solid defense, big play guys, and they've got a huge wide receiver in Noah Bell, 6'4". Eight interceptions just set the record for the Hornets, man. I'm telling Noah Ball's, a, that, Noah Ball's a man down there. I'm telling you, getting it done. I, never, I didn't have a 6'4 receiver until I went to the NFL, <laughs> let alone a baseball or even mount. I didn't have a 6'4 guy. And they got so, yeah. 280 tackles, too, man. Will Steinberg and Frank McClellan. For D7 and school to have. For, for Malvern to have that, that's a big deal down there. Matt Churko's doing a good job, man. He's a hornet. He's a hornet through and through. They're going to sting him. You know, and they're rolling into the playoffs coming off their big one.